Football is officially back in Broncos country. It's a new season and Denver is embracing its new head coach and new culture. Go Broncos! Even though it's the middle of summer, for some people, the start of training camp feels like the holidays. Oh, it is Christmas morning. My family knows. They know already, man. I'm here. I was here at 6 o'clock this morning. Um, I usually come earlier. But, you know, I was running a little late today. After a disappointing 2022 season, one super fan believes Sean Payton is the man to turn things around. He's going to be Sean Payton. That uh, just that simple. Sean Payton is going to come in here. I, we've already you know, seen how he's going to change the culture based on the interview yesterday, and uh, that's going to carry through. People are concerned that he's created a bulletin board material for the Jets. I think he created a bulletin board material for the Broncos. Coach Payton is not known for sugarcoating and says he's expecting his team to end the seven year playoff drought. That mindset needs to be present here. And, and so, yeah, I, I, I see this as a team that has that ability and it's our job to bring out bring it out in him. It's year two in Denver for Russell Wilson, who had the worst season of his career last year. But his offseason work seems to have set him up for success. You know, I feel better than ever. I think that um, it was a great offseason and just all the hard work uh, is paying off. And this type of optimism is feeding right into Broncos country. I, I predict him to get a little further than last year for sure, definitely. So uh, at least playoff. 20 and 0, we're undefeated till we ain't. The Broncos haven't had a winning season since the 2015-2016 Super Bowl run. So while Sean Payton's changes seem drastic, they're necessary. We'll have to wait and see if it all pays off. Reporting from day one of Broncos training camp, I'm Brady King, News 5 Sports.